254 breadboard showing to see if your mechanism actually works. What's up, Jens? Hey. I'm making a video. Can you show me? Video? Oh, yeah. Can yeah, you, sure. can you show me like the spinning thing? I want to um, just mark it so you really see that it's. Uh, the, uh, one of them are spinning faster than the other. Mm -hmm. So there are red dots, and I'm uh, making a red dot here too. So uh, it should be a lot about this turns three times, and this one turns so one time. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's one, one. two, three. They're very nice, man. So, what will it? What what is the toy gonna end up look like? It's gonna be. Um, let me show you. Oh. Hovercraft. Yes. Like uh, this one, for instance. Oh, okay. It's gonna be a big fan here, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna have. Uh, it's not gonna go in water, but. Uh, so you're gonna want it to actually go into water too? No, 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 no. No. Uh, I'm gonna just. Uh, play with it on the tabletop. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna have some wheels here, some mechanisms mm -hmm. to increase the speed of some... Uh, to make the fan go really fast and then have an American flag here, mm -hmm. which are gonna wave in the wind. Why an American flag? Because uh, I'm American now. Okay. I'm uh, waiting for my American <laughs> driver's right, my sounds... California driver's license. Mm -hmm. So I feel uh, really American. Good. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hey Tyler, can you show me yours, please? Yeah, I can. Thank you. So what is this, Tyler? This is supposed to be a robotic panther. Robotic. It's similar to this one. Mm -hmm. Trying to. And the point is moving the gear on the top. So this is the thigh, right? This yeah, like this a is leg. the back thigh. Mm -hmm. And these two uh, two pieces move together. And there will be more linkage in the back, attached at the hip. It'll simulate the leg moving. Right. You also want like the front legs to do, and then the the head as well. Yes. Sweet. It'll be a head moving probably. Yeah, it's supposed to be pretty sick. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Shayla. Sorry to interrupt. Hi. Can I see yours? Can you show me? Show me it. Oh. I'm making a video right now. Oh, you are. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Yours is so cute. Thank you so much. <laughs> so cute and it works anyway, well. This is my pin and what is it? What's it called? Rack and pinion. Rack and pinion. Mm -hmm. So the little like monocle is gonna be sticking out right here, and then you go like that, and you move it, and then it's gonna light up. Mm -hmm. And then it closes again. So this is a steampunk. Steampunk uh, bunny. Bunny. Uh, yeah. Uh. Nice. Is is there gonna be anything else other than this? Oh yeah. Okay. There's gonna be that right here, something like that. Dang! Look at that. Here. Let's let's watch it in action. <laughs> Look at that. That's ridiculous. That's for the belly. Just the top part though. Hold up. Let's move it. I'm sealing this guy. Just the top part right here. Yeah. So that's the belly. Sweet. Very nice. Thank you, Shayla. You're welcome. Do you have yours? Yeah. Can I see it? You want me? <laughs> So what is this gonna be? Um, this is gonna be a dragonfly, and this is the tail, and like, just imagine the wings like are okay. attached there. And so my idea, I guess, is like to have the tail move. And I couldn't really figure that out, but I know it moves though when I move the gears. So it, it wants to stay. Mm -hmm. So like, uh, it goes like that. Oh, sweet. Yeah. What would you do to? What would start the motion? Rolling it or? I was hoping the tail would like you'd have your dragonfly and just move the tail and like the wings. Would oh, okay. And stuff, but I have to figure out like how to get the tail to work. Yeah. All right. Thank you for showing it to me. Jordan, making a video. Can you show me yours, dude? Sure. So what is it gonna be? Uh, forklift. Forklift. Yeah. Hopefully hand operated. Yeah. So you'll would it be originally this? Like you move this by hand? Yeah, exactly. But oh, this will okay. be this these blades need to stay parallel to the ground. Mm-hmm. 
Is that, that way it lifts level. Yeah. So this will be the main function, right? This will be all? Uh, and then steering. Oh, okay. Steer the You'll have the rack and pinion kind of thing? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yep. Thanks, man. <laughs> hey, Michael. Hey, check this Dude, out. I'm making a video right now, man. Hey, check, hey, make a video of this video. Dude, this is a homosexual video. <laughs> no. <laughs> he said, it's, it's basically what he's saying is, people get stressed out during finals, so I'm going to go and have pillow fights with them to help them not be so stressful. I see. Look at this video. Dude. It's the best thing in the world. He just walks up to random people, hands them a pillow, and starts fighting them. That's funny. <laughs> hey, well, my video is about your thing, man. Can you show it to me? Okay. What is it about? It's about compressed air as a source of power. Mm -hmm. So this thing is like a fan turbine, in which theoretically if you were to blow air into it at a high speed, it would power the mechanisms. These mm -hmm. The can, two feet walk. The cam and crank, yes. Yeah. So the okay. feet walk. And then and the, the cams raise these little things up. Right. And, down. and this is a steampunk kind of creature, huh? Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking I associate steampunk with compressed uh, pressure mm -hmm. because it's all steam powered. And I think that'd be cool if I was doing a steampunk aesthetic with a steampunk source of power. Yeah, yeah. sweet. Yeah. Thank you, Michael. Excuse me. Jade. What's up? Making a video. <laughs> Can you show off your truck, dude? My truck? Yeah. I'm researching suspension right now. Let's go, dude. Let's go. <laughs> Let me see it in action, man. So this is a trophy truck, huh? Yeah, Racing it's a trophy truck. truck. And it's got the, uh, you know, axle that moves. Sweet. Yeah, don't do wood for your first breadboard. Oh, stay. yeah. <laughs> Way too long to cut those out. And then the can shop. Yeah, yeah. and then it's and then supposed to run the belt, but the belt's not running right now. It's got too much tension. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Thank you. Yep. Sam. Oh, Sam. Soup man. Right. Sam the soup man. Soup man Sam. Can you show me your thing, dude? Your breadboard? Oh, breadboard. Pretty please? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Maybe for later. <laughs> you know, we <laughs> so this is a dude on a motorcycle, right? A robot, man. A robot on a motorcycle? Yeah. Dude, your thing works really well. Yeah, you, you just have to have the big things. Mm -hmm. Looks good. And so you're going to have somehow make it connect together, or it's just going to be two separate mechanisms? It's going to be two separate mechanisms. It'll be like that. Oh, okay. The back wheels are way back here. Mm -hmm. Sweet. So the back rear wheel is smaller than the front one? Yeah. Okay. Nice, man. Thank you. Sure. All right, Evan. Jimmy! Bust it out. Bust out the oh. airplane. Well, my breadboard doesn't really work very well. It's all good. It's the first um, one. First one, yeah. But basically, the idea is there's this wheel in the back right here, mm -hmm. and this would turn, and this is out of place. But it would turn this center axle, which would touch touch up on uh, this uh, wheel over right. here, which would lead into the wing, which would get another gear, which would hold the propeller. So the propeller will spin, and then the propeller will be spinning as you roll it. Of course, I made this propeller so it's like on the board, so yeah. I didn't make enough room for it to spin. But what, what would the wing mechanism do? Also spin? Um. Well, I haven't figured out if I if I'm going to make the uh, oh the flaps yeah. go. Mm -hmm. But if I did, I mean, I guess I could do some sort of like maybe quick return thing where if it go if it moved up and it would maybe like have a right. some sort of connection and it would push that down. Okay. Um, so I, I'll see if there's oh. even enough room in the wing since it's so tiny. But okay. Thank you. So that's basically what's going on. Looks good, man. Keep it up. Thanks. Hey, Tommy, stay. Gangi. Gangi. Yeah. Alvin. What? Can you show me yours, dude? Let's yeah. see how it works. I'm making a video right now. Okay. So this is going to be a monster truck. And the wheels turn, and it moves the pistons, right? Yeah. Pistons? Sweet, dude. Thank you. Tommy, I'm making a video right now. Can you show me yours, man?
So what is it going to be? It's going to be an ambulance. An ambulance. What is it going to do? Uh, so it's going to be a... Uh, there's a front wheel. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to move, become a bevel gear, and um, try to make the... Make the light um, Spin. rotate, rotate mm -hmm. while it's running. Okay. Yeah. Hey, would that all? Would that is that it, or are you gonna have the two front wheels move, or? Oh yeah, hopefully. Um, hopefully I can make it elastic powered. Yeah. Like a pull back. Oh okay. Yeah. Thanks, man. All right. See. You. <laughs> Patrick. This one's yours, Andrew? Can you cut my face instead of doing my faces? What'd you say? <laughs> Patrick, I'm making a video. Oh, um... <laughs> can, can you show me your thing, dude? I put, uh, slits on the back. Oh, sh... You know, wide. So what is it gonna be, dude? Um, it just breaks. It's supposed to be a rally car. Oh. Except it's binding right now. There you go. Dude. Oh, also... Um, made out of connects? So you turn so it, the the two front wheels supposed to turn, the heads of the, the heads fall razor the are supposed to turn. For my dad's company. Nice. My Thank you, Patrick. Thing to do for a Did you get Andrews? I was going to show Matt, but uh, it's out of yeah, operation right now. What is this supposed to do, though? This is supposed to spin and make the uh, cylinder heads go up and down. And this is a motorcycle, right? Yeah, it's a motorcycle. Sweet. Thank you, Matt. No problem, Jimmy. <laughs> yeah, I post on Facebook. Andrew. So they Andrew, can you show me yours, dude? Oh, yeah. This is a video art, sorry. Oh. Alright, sure. So what is this supposed to be? I don't even know where it looks. It's a it's forklift. Forklift, okay. And it has two separate mechanisms. And one for the rack and pinion here, mm -hmm. which is supposed to show a lever also when that is activated. And this is for the lift, which is when it drives. Mm -hmm. it, Controls the lever as well and raises and lowers the lift with the super kidding. Okay, sweet. Thank you, Andrew. <laughs> Where did Brian go? Oh, Brian. Hey, Brian, what's your thing? Bust it out. I think you're the last one, too. Other than me, I guess. Yeah, why don't you show yours I will, eventually. And it's like, and now that you've seen how everyone else looks here. So there's Brian. It's supposed to be a steampunk shark. And supposedly the crank, the these gears move, and then I have a camshaft down here. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to power the pistons, but I messed up on the pistons. So. Okay. So what is it supposed to do? It's supposed to, um, the toy itself is supposed to, I'm supposed to grab the back. Okay. Either the propeller or the turbine itself, and then crank it. Mm -hmm. And then so, the and the gears sort of move. The two top parts which should move. Well, there's supposed to be more parts because it's. But I'm just trying to replicate like to, to see how it actually works. Yeah. So like I need to fix how like the guidance and everything for all the little pistons and whatnot. What about so what what do these represent? Um, I'm gonna have on the a, shark. Do I have a picture? I have a yeah. It's, it's a like a. Sort of, we're short on time, dude. Short on time? Damn. Okay, never mind. I'll just describe <laughs> it with my hands. Um, it's basically like, um, just, just imagine like the valves and, uh, of a saxophone. I mean, uh -huh. open and close. And so just the cams will just cause it to open and close and open and close. Okay. And then it's, it won't be pistons, but like it will be, it'll have pistons underneath or something mm -hmm. to push it up and down, up and down. I see. Yeah. All right. Thank you. All right, fast. This one's mine. Very plain right now, but I'm making a uh, FJ Cruiser. This is a rack and pinion method where you turn the rear spare wheel and the two front wheels should move. I figured out a better way to do it that allows for suspension. And what I'm also going to do is have the charge up method where you charge the car up and the rear wheel spins, which will allow it to continue and go on its own. But that's mine. Thank you for watching. Long video. Bye.